Hello, everybody. I'm back. I, I never left. I did leave for a little bit. I took a little bit of a hiatus, but I'm here. I'm back with another reaction video. Today's reaction video comes from another comment from you guys, so thank you for that. The video I'm going to be reacting to in real time is CL Spicy. I'm going to guess it's a Korean K-pop group. Maybe it's uh, an artist. I don't know. I do see this giant gold dude here, though, so uh, we're going to find out what this guy's about. If you don't know who I am, my name is Maddie. I'm a music artist, a music producer. And I'm going to give you my perspective on this song from a music production standpoint. What's happening in some of the treble, some of the bass, and some of the frequency spectrum. And does it sound good? What's going on? Maybe I can give you some insights like that. Let's get into it. CL Spicy, thank you for the suggestion. Here we go. Excuse me. Do you have that sauce that is spicy? <laughs> Made in Korea. Made in Korea. Gotta be Korean. Nice. You have that. Okay, what's happening right here? We have a nice ping pong effect. That means in coming out from each speaker individually, right, left, right, left. Just boom, 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 boom. Sounds good. Oh, sort of lagging, slowing down a little bit. Is that first drop when that sub came in just right on the root note sounds like a minor chord to me just boom sounds nice Okay, building it up, building it up. Continue with that same melody, that bum 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 bum, and that sub is going double time. The sub sounds so good. It's just staying on the same note. It doesn't have to change notes because just the melody and that dun 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 is isn't changing. That so it doesn't have to change notes at all. It doesn't have to change chords, but it sounds delightful. Let's hear this drop. The siren in the background. You got the sauce and it's spicy. You rocking with the most fly Asians? Okay. Okay. Uh, wow. Amazing. Okay, okay, stop it there. It seems like we don't even have differentiated sections of this song. It's just going to keep with that same melody the whole time and that sub. I don't, I haven't heard the sub even change notes from that. And I haven't heard the melody change from the song or drop out. Usually in songs, you'll have a verse, maybe a, a chorus, a pre chorus, maybe even a post chorus. And each of those sections of the song could have a different structure or different chords or, or something different. But it just seems like what's happening here is they're just dropping out other elements besides the melody and the sub to give it some variety. Some percussion is being added. Some other elements are being added to differentiate the sections. And it works. I think that <laughs> these sections don't necessarily need to have too much else added to them. It's a very solid melody and a very solid sub. And that combo is going to keep this whole song going through. We'll see if it changes up in the bridge. But from the way that it's happened so far, we'll see. We'll see. <laughs> chicken noodle chicken noodle soup rice korean what got the sauce and it's spicy got the sauce and it's spicy the riser the drums are going a little bit faster building it up Asian. 
소리 들과 가식 박힌 고정감들 뚫어가 내 반식 감히 내 걱정을 하다니 이제 느끼지도 않지 간식조차 없는 반치는 이들 잔치 Spice on him Okay, so right there, that's where the melody finally dropped out. We have a different section. Uh, nice. It's, you know, switching it up a little bit. I, my guess is that it's going to drop out even more from what I just heard. And then it will build it back up into a final chorus in that same melody. Bum, 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 bum. Let's check it out. Oh, you can hear it filtered. You can hear that melody being filtered in. Yep, ping pong effect, changing stereo speakers, right and left. Some intense percussion rhythm. Brings back with the chorus. I totally dig that rhythm part, that like percussion, percussion rhythm. Let me go back just a little bit. It sounds like it's almost hitting, uh, it could be like a xylophone maybe you note, know, or it's just like hitting like a glass bottle. Cool, loved it. There it is. That says something. This definitely says something. Oh, look at that bicep. She's been lifting. <laughs> Anyways. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. See how spicy. Very nice. Very nice. Was it spicy? Yeah. Was it too hot to handle? Mm, I don't think it was too hot to handle, but I did like it. I did enjoy it. CL Spicy. 17 million views. Is this the original vi video? Sometimes I look at these videos and they're just totally not the original music video. Let me search that. No, I do see her on Hot Ones. Eating spicy wings from her song, Spicy. Classic. Nice. Good fit. Good marketing there by, their, by her team. Anyways, what did I think about the song? What was going on? It was... Pretty simple song. It didn't change a lot. The melody really carried the song as well as the sub. I don't think the sub changed a note the entire time. However, the note that it was on was very perfect. It was a good note. <laughs> it was just the root of whatever minor chord that melody was being played and that supported the entire song. The drums and the bass were mixed really well together. And then on top of that, you had the melody and then fit in between there were the vocals and that was pretty much the whole song this song was simple but those are sometimes the most effective songs the simpler you can do with arrangement and production like this sometimes the better result you get especially for a pop song there doesn't need to be a ton of elements the elements that are there should be catchy but you don't need to overdo it it's easy to add spots to fill in the frequency spectrum and add pads and add different instruments because it sounds more full but that can turn into really quickly getting too busy and overwhelming for the listener. So just having a few elements, a few memorable parts of the song, having some good lyrics, like talking about being in South Korea and being spicy and got some spicy sauce. Sure. Absolutely. I love it. It's great. I don't know a lot about CL. It's not, I'm not sure if she's a new artist or this comment says CL's comeback. It's made everyone's day better. So maybe she was an old artist. Maybe she was a part of a different K-pop group and now she's doing a solo career. I have no idea. Best of luck though, CL. Keep it up. Keep dipping those chicken nuggets in some spicy sauces and <laughs> keep making some good beats. My only real critique of this song was I would have liked to see some more differentiation amongst the sections, maybe adding some more elements. You did see that a little bit with the percussion and some of the rhythm parts with the drum section going a little bit faster or going double time or adding in some different elements you hadn't heard before. But I think this song could have been a little bit more interesting if there was a little bit more build up and no, nah, I guess maybe not build up's the right word, but a little bit more more difference between some of the parts could have made for more of an emotional release when the drop happened or more of a roller coaster of emotions as some of these other k-pop songs i've heard have done other than that that's really my only qualm with the song cl spicy awesome job i dig it nice production amazing amazing sounding the rap was good in english i was guessing it was good in korean too i like the lyrics i like the novelty of it i think writing songs that are just supposed to get the people going and talking about spicy sauce can get the people going for sure. So nice job, CL. I will probably be seeing you in the future, I imagine, like in real life. I just feel a connection. 
between us. I could see it in the screen. Probably going to meet. So <laughs> if you want to make that happen, let me know. That will do it for my analysis and my first time reaction to CL Spicy. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for tuning in. Peace.